Hey everybody, um, I'm really fine for doing these videos, but I'm uh, gonna try and get out of my comfort zone today and uh, do something a bit different. Um, give a tour of this amazing venue, Red Rocks in Denver, Colorado, with uh, Killer Queen, tribute to Queen from the UK. And uh, well, it's one of the coolest venues in the world for sure. And definitely one of my favorite places in the world. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go down to the stage, have a look around, go up top, see the views, and then take a sneaky peek backstage. And uh, yeah, if you wanna come along, join me. Back on the stage, and uh, this view is just amazing. And it's our fourth time playing here, and it always, it just feels like the first time coming here, it just blows you away. Um, it's a surreal, visceral experience. Playing good here, I must say. The crowd, the energy from the crowd, almost 9,000 people here, it's just insane. Uh, yeah, the stage is really deep. We only have used half of it. It's got a new canopy here. Just put in a 2020. And this, we never, we never had a backdrop or a stage set the first three times we played here. It was, Kind of weird we look like matchstick men on the stage here. <laughs> but we've got this amazing set now that's been built by our lighting engineer Travis. Just completely transformed the show. Really nice. Got the uh, Brian May guitars here. This is Brian May's birthday today, so happy birthday Dr. May. Uh, Factor audio. With all the amp sounds. Just an amazing bit of kit. So that was the stage, and uh, now I'm gonna take a little hike up top. You can uh, you can really feel the altitude here, um, especially when you get up top. It's uh, obviously Denver's the mile high city, and then you get even higher going up here. So yeah, and uh, boy, am I out of shape. <laughs> I used to three. I used to swim three miles a day. Unbelievable. These trees here, which is always nice. Um, it really feels like you're at one with nature. So we're right near the top here, and uh, yeah, the rocks really kind of tower up here. Such an amazing view. I don't know if you can see it there, but you can just see the. Denver skyline from up here. Uh, it's just incredible. So as soon as you come backstage, all the, all the fame and all the, the amazing artists that played in the um, It's one of my favourites. Complete package. <laughs> Show there. So these are the dressing rooms here, um, and yeah, what's really cool is how the, the red rock encroaches into the room, and um, the massage chairs, oh, it's nice and flowers, <laughs> yeah, I bet these walls can tell some stories, eh? This is the catering here, some of the crew tucking in already, don't blame them, always great food. Always looked after. Lovely, lovely staff here. Ah, oh, there's a iconic moment in the history of Red Rocks, and in the history of you too, I guess. There's BB. And, uh, what else have we got here? Ah, uh, there's some uh, really cool pictures of the, the history of the place. The uh, place being built. Some early. And uh, this is like a, a list that everyone has played it through the years. Starting back in the 60s. Um, so yeah, everyone plays it. It's a, it's a little spot on the wall. Yeah. 
there's little old us. <laughs> Talk about imposter syndrome. Wow. This is the ramp that goes up to the stage. And uh, I guess this is where the, uh, the adrenaline starts pumping. <laughs> That was my little tour of Red Rocks. Hope you enjoyed it. If you've made it this far, uh, well done for listening to me joining on. <laughs> um, obviously, we're incredibly grateful to be here. Um, it's a real honour and a privilege to, to be on the stage. And, um, yeah, it's definitely one of the highs of the tour. Anyone who does touring knows that it's a roller coaster of emotions from. Uh, you know, the euphoria of playing nice gigs, seeing nice places and connecting with new people to, you know, occasionally insomnia and uh, loneliness. <laughs> it's pretty lonely sometimes, uh, even though you're traveling with a group. It's uh, not what you see on Instagram. But uh, yeah, sending love to everyone. And we're missing some people here for sure. Um, yeah, see you soon.